How's it going guys? January 1st, 2021. Brand new update for the year. We're gonna check the ammo inventory here at Sportsman's Warehouse in Anchorage, Alaska, Southside. We got some intel that they got some nine mil, so let's go check it out if they still have any. Uh, this intel was about 20 minutes ago, so I'm pretty excited to see what the new year has for us today. Okay, so I know there's been a lot of rumors about manufacturers, ammo and stuff like that, how they were saying that the manufacturers were holding all, all the ammo, um, but we figured out that was false. But now there's also <laughs> rumors saying that the stores are the one who's hiding the ammo in the back of their building or in the back of their uh, their warehouse until they want to put it out so there's been a rumor about that and uh we've been hearing a lot of the workers gossiping about that rumor so we don't know if it's true or not but let me know what you guys think in the comments are the workers corporation holding up the ammo for us and uh, keeping them away until they're ready to put it out on the on the floor or what is the deal we don't know here's all the reloads Reload has been the same here. 50 mil primers. All the primers are pretty much low on stock. So I just checked that end cap where the 9 mil was and it's completely empty already. And that's what's this. That was within uh, 20 minutes since we got the update. And all the 9 mils are out already. Man, that's crazy, guys. What a crazy day, man. And it's New Year. It's New Year's. You would think people be sleeping in or something. But everybody's out buying ammo. <laughs> so a couple months ago, last month or so, they had a five limit box, but now it's all back to two limit. <laughs> but two's the limit now. Crazy, man. 260. Here's some 270. 270 anywhere from $40 up to 50 bucks. There's some cheaper 270, $223, 7-0. Man, this is crazy. All the 9 mils already out. That's crazy. There's some 50 BMG, $55. 375. Buffalo Boar. This is the end cap of it. They had it for 16 bucks. That's crazy. Here's some 380. 380 for $22. Man. I'm not gonna show you guys all the bullets on the reload section, but uh, you guys get most of the point here. I mean, they have a good selection, but not a, actually they don't have a good selection, but they have a okay selection. <laughs> Here's some smokeless powder and again, I'm not a reload expert, so I don't know what these go to but maybe you guys can let us know in the comment section shotgun uh, So these are all shotgun smokeless propellant <coughs> They don't have any price which is very common nowadays They just I think these thing goes out so fast that they just put on the shelf and then people don't care about the price They just pay for whatever it comes out to so Reload section reload section So this is the shotgun section here I don't know if we have any shotgun fans watching this video, but we have some shotgun, 20 gauge. All of these are 12 gauge over here. A lot, a lot of burst shots, burst shots, and uh, seven and a half, eight, eight shot. So all for target and burst shooting and stuff like that. All the slugs are gone though. This is usually where all the slugs are. They got some 16 gauge right here. $15 so plenty of shotgun anywhere from 12 gauge to a 20 gauge but most of it is just bird shots which is you know you can still use it for home defense or whatever you're whether whatever the case you're trying to do <coughs> here's some 20 gauge two and three quarters seven eight uh, seven eight ounce shots seven and a half ounce shots <coughs> so this stuff is usually good for birds and stuff like that small games man they're out of all the ammo here so we didn't find no nine mil I'm gonna try to ask the, uh, I'm gonna ask one of the workers and see if they have any more in the back. I wanna try to sneak into this back right here and see if they have some ammo hidden. I think that might be the case here. I know you guys like it when I show you guys some of the guns here in Alaska, some of the prices and stuff. It's very hard to see the price from here, but um, hopefully you guys get the point. So these are all shotgun selection right here. Pump action, or some of these are semi-autos I think. 
I like the semi semi auto shotgun. Pump action is really nice too. They have some lever action here. Some more shotgun. <coughs> and then they do have some uh, AR style right here too. I'm not sure what these guys are here, but they got some pretty cool stuff here. These are some of the Berettas and Benelli's. Nor the higher end shotgun. So plenty of shotguns. I'm not sure why nobody's buying shotguns during this time. I guess everybody wants handgun in uh, AR style. But for the record, yes, there was ammo today. It, there was nine mil ammo. Um, that's a fact. It's just that we are just like five, 10 minutes late. Um, I saw a lot of people, I saw a lot of people with the nine mil ammo and they had more than two box. Like one guy had four box and I didn't see a wife or a friend or anybody. So maybe he was holding it for somebody, but a lot of people do that. Um, you know, it's kind of, it's not really fair, but it's kind of, you know, it depends on what you guys want to look at it for. So the guys behind the counter, they're super busy. So I wasn't able to ask them if there was any more ammunition in the back of their, of their stockpile. I have a good feeling that they do have some more ammunition, some 9 mil in the back of their, of their uh, warehouse still. I feel like they're taking out maybe a thousand round. Uh, a day or I feel like they're just taking out a small quantity because I know I, I, I have a feeling that they that they have more ammunition in the back and maybe they are controlling the amount that they put out so who knows like I said uh, we heard a we heard some rumors were that um, a customer was talking to one of the associate last week and the associates like yeah we have some nine mil but we're told not to put them out yet and that was on a Wednesday and then yesterday um, there was a no ammo um, Wednesday and Tuesday, so Tuesday and Wednesday I did check ammunition but I didn't make any videos because there was nothing so I didn't want to make a video but then this whole week they didn't put anything out but then today they decided to put something out so we don't know if those rumors are true maybe if anyone has intel about this maybe it might be true but we've been hearing a lot of rumors from here and also downstate where associates from Bass Pros or Cabela's they're holding the ammunition in the back of their in their in their stock rooms until they're told to put them out on the floor so who knows if that's true enough but anyways that's ammo update for you guys for january 1st 2021 hopefully we have a great year and again we'll come back and check some more of these stores this week and hopefully they do have more ammunition whether it's 9 mil or 223 whatever the case may be they did have some uh 380 but again we didn't need any 380 but they did have 380 available just for the record I'll catch you guys next time and let me know in the comments section below what your status is and let us know what state you're from, what city you're from. Talk to you guys later. Bye-bye.